Yo, one hour away to, uh, we head to the arena to do, um, you know, the mock uh, broadcast for tonight. How do you feel? I feel good. I feel good. It's, it's boxing. It's, I lived this. Now I just have to talk about it. Do you feel, how does it, how does it make you feel knowing that the zone and matchroom reach out and think you should be more on the broadcast end sometimes? Um, what what fight was that? The WBC fight with Erica Farias? After after welcoming everybody to Chicago during the press conference, um, and just kind of saying my spiel, somebody from the zone came up to me and was like, "I know you're boxing right now, but when you retire, we will have a job for you." Mm -hmm. So I don't know. I just I I went to college for this, so it's very normal. And then, you know, we talk to people and, and do a lot of public speaking so it's very normal um and i think i've just shown that every time they put the camera on me so so like yesterday during the kind of meeting kind of the roll call of who's involved and everything you know they had mentioned <clears throat> your name a few times saying just for this fight and other fights going forward you being on the broadcast team um you know how does that make you feel just in general like, I mean, they didn't officially offer a job, but they basically said it. Um, it's cool. I mean, I, I got into boxing to box, so I don't really know how I feel about it because I, I definitely could have done this with my college experience. Mm -hmm. And I guess I was looking to get more on the wild side of life, and that's why I'm boxing. But um, it's cool. Just, you know, they, they recognize the efforts that I put in to do a good job. You know, I don't ever want to do anything like half-ass, so... Um, it's important that I I represent you and my team and the gym properly uh, and myself of course properly and I think that's being seen. Yeah, I think this is more of a um, a bigger role on the broadcast then, and you know you get to uh, you know call Mikey Garcia's fight as you'll call the first two fights of the night, but yeah. but also get a you know tidbits on the Mikey yeah. Garcia and. You know, it's a little comforting seeing as though we came from Riverside, you know, yeah, and checked think, out Mikey and Big yeah, G and it's Robert. It's kind of like perfect timing because, you know, I feel uh, a certain closeness to those guys. You know, they're very welcoming and um, I, I wish the best for him tonight. And it's, it's very cool to be involved with his fight. Good, good. And uh, what do you expect for tonight? Um... I'm looking forward to a couple of fights that, that aren't going to be on the main broadcast. Like, Bam's not on the main broadcast, right? Mm. Nope. He is. He, yeah. Yeah, he's, yeah, the, he's one the I'm second do. one. He's the one I'm doing, right? Yeah, Bam? the first yes, two right. first two of the broadcast. Um, so I can't wait to see to see his fight. I hope, I mean, you, 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 you hope they get knockouts if that's what they want. But, you know, I like Bam's style. And so I kind of don't want to see a fast fight. You yeah. Know? I want to see what Brock is all about. I want to see him in in action you know I, there's not a lot of current fights of him out there on the internet and he looks like you know he's getting he's filling into his body a little bit more he's mm -hmm. kind of getting that man strength and so i'm just interested to see what he brings to the table uh and then of course the main card um you know i just it, there's been conversation about you know mikey is he going to overlook this fight is he looking towards the next fight too much um is he going to underperform is you know and what, what could happen if, if things don't go the way that he wants, you know, and the way that he wants could be a knockout. If he wins and doesn't get a knockout, is that still good? That's boxing, yeah. you know, yeah. it's so, so iffy like that. Yeah, that's cool. Any, uh, any last words for everybody? Um, check me out. I'll be on at 4.30 and intermittently, uh, thrown in the broadcast here and there. And, um, excited to to be on the broadcast and hope you guys enjoy the fights tonight.